I have an electric yellow bikini already put together, blue cotton yarn and some metallic embroidery floss for my embellishments. To bring this into the year 2077, I have some glow-in-the-dark and neon paint that I'll apply to make my bikini light up. Starting with the embroidery for blue lines, I will make three rows on the outer edge of the cup. I will be doing an embroidery stitch called chain stitch, but instead of cutting a length of thread and embroidering in with a needle, I will create the stitch by sticking the hook through the work and pulling through the yarn from the other side. It's so much quicker and easier to do it this way, especially as I'm following the same direction as the crochet row. I took inspiration for this from the advertising graphics and the neon blue lines inset into some of the costumes for a few of the characters. You might notice that I haven't attached this bikini cup to the other one yet. I've done this because I know I'm going to paint both and I don't want the string to get in the way. These things need to be easy to handle. This is only my first month on YouTube. If you'd like to support me, I would love a subscribe. If you'd like to see a specific theme covered, please let me know in the comments. I'm really looking forward to getting into some Christmassy fun over December. When you get to the end of the row, snip the yarn and pull through. Repeat this for the second and third rows. There are two reasons why I chose to do this embroidery. The first is that the lines of the paint will shrink, so the blue yarn will show through after that. The second reason is that embroidery will reinforce the fabric and stop it from stretching as much. This will reduce the strain on the paint and it will help to minimise cracking. Turning the corner at the peak of the bikini is made easy just by following the increased stitches that we put into the chain one space at the top. Just be careful that you are not making the stitches too tight or it will cause the fabric to bunch in the wrong places. I put three blue lines on each cup so that they match. I also embroider in the metallic line across the cup. This references the lines that mark out where cybernetic implants are connected into the body. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments on what sort of cybernetic implant could possibly follow this line. What would be on your wish list? I apply the fabric paint along the embroidered lines. I will actually do two lines of paint side by side. Crochet stitches will always stretch out, so I accept that this paint will definitely crack somewhere at some point. I think the embroidery underneath will act as a bit of reinforcement though, in addition to providing another bit of depth in the blue. Making thick lines also seems to help avoid cracking. I am so excited to be applying this glow in the dark paint. I really do hope that the delay in deployment for this game provides an opportunity to add the value needed to meet everybody's expectations. And there we have it, 
a crochet bikini with an electric blue twist. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know through a like and a comment below. If you would like to see me make more geeky bikinis, please subscribe.